Welcome to where we've stayed here in Ireland. And we've already been in here and we're getting ready to leave. So I'm just giving a quick overview of our room. This is the kitchen. We made a hearty breakfast, bacon and eggs and toast and yogurt. And this is the laundry room, the washer and dryer, and refrigerator. It's cute little things that they have. And the nice back door, and a little backyard. Not much of one, but it's been really nice. Now the room I showed first was where Barb stayed. We had some other people that was staying here last night and they were upstairs. So we weren't part of the upstairs part. And then this is the one, as you can see, we already slept in them, but it was three beds in here, but it worked. The reason we chose the twin beds, Steve and I, is because we're so big and those, what they consider a king size bed is for us a, a queen. And we're used to a king. And I think their queen is still smaller than our queen's. We had another bedroom in here. Just charming little rooms, you know. Just sweet as can be. Sorry if I'm making anybody dizzy. I'm just trying to make a real quick overview of what we did. Then they have this living room, which was so nice. i got to take a step down. Last night we came in, and he... When he came back from dinner, he had a, the owner here had a really nice fire going in the fireplace. And we just sat in, he had the TV on. We didn't really watch the TV, but um, we just sat in here and completely just relaxed and thoroughly enjoyed our stay. It was so peaceful and, and nice. It was wonderful. And so, this was the inside of the house. I started from outside, but I'm going to go finish outside. Here. Nice and sunny. And we have not had hardly any rain, thank you, Lord, since we've been here. We have got this little Volkswagen caddy here. We had a Mercedes in England. And this thing's a beater in a way. The Mercedes was... It's trying to be purple in some lights. <laughs> yeah, this, the, yeah, it, it tries to be purple in some lights, and other lights it's blue, and others it looks black. It's interesting. <laughs> Tell you to rent a car in in Ireland is a whole lot more expensive than it is to rent it in England. But it's just this cute little house. Sorry, I'm I'm kind of walking backwards down a a slope. But isn't that a cute little place? And then the garden here is just incredibly pretty. I tell you, the weather in May, at least for this year, 2018, is incredible. Oh, today is wedding day, isn't it? I do believe it is today. It's the big wedding day here in, in England for, for Prince uh, Harry. Look at the views. We're out in the country. Funny, it's here in um, England and Ireland. What they do is they cluster together so tight. And this to us is just a driveway. But that's the size of the streets. <laughs> and they cluster everything really tight. And there's just miles and miles of open fields. Everything is free ranged out here. Don't have to worry about free ranging their cows. And we had I had a glass of milk this morning that was incredible. It was just fresh, raw. I don't know, they might lightly pasteurize it, but very lightly. Full fat. I mean, it was the best tasting milk you've ever had. The yogurt here, oh my gosh, you buy a 69 cent yogurt that is nasty in America. Over here, it is the best quality that we paid top bucks for in America for to get something that's even equivalent 
to what you pay 69 euros for here. I, it's unbelievable. The quality of their yogurts and their cheeses. We was in a, a 7-Eleven type of store. And we bought some cheddar cheese. Oh my gosh. When I go to Whole Paycheck, I mean Whole, Whole Foods <laughs> in, in Colorado, I have to pay triple what I paid for this just at a convenience store. The cheese that we get in our convenience stores are horrible. <laughs> so just letting y'all know. It is incredible, the difference here in quality of food. You know, some of it is a lot to be desired. Tastes like their sausage. Yeah. It's a, it's a English and, and uh, Irish way of eating sausage. It's not an American sausage, that's for sure. It's a little bit bizarre and different, but the bacon sure is good. I'm sure not disappointed in anything that uh, I've tasted other than that sausage, maybe. Anyway, I guess I will cut this for here and save room for another video at another beautiful spot. So, take care and God bless.